what's up guys so today we are going to be reviewing these magic pro solar powered motion sensing outdoor security lights now there's a mofo okay so let's take a good look at this box as we can see here it's the magic pro our boxes are made of boxes with a bass hashtag recycle and this product is made in china now two lights came in this box guys i bought this product from amazon one of those lights is already installed outdoors and we are going to be taking a look at that light a little later in this video now i am going to do an unboxing as if i didn't know what came in this box Okay guys, so the items that came in the box, one good old user manual. The items that you would need for installation, four screws and four wall plugs. And last but certainly not least is the Magic Pro solar powered motion sensing light now if you take a good look at this light guys it's not the most beautiful light but it is not an ugly light either now what i would say is that it is fairly large in the hand it has a nice long solar panel and as you would know with a solar powered light in order to get the internal battery charge you need to get the solar panel in direct sunlight or as close as possible. Now this light has 136 LEDs. Did you count them? No, I did not, but I believe the documentation. Now this light illuminates from the front, from the sides, and it also illuminates downward as well. In the middle of the device, we have the motion sensor. This is the part of the device that detects motion. Now this light is waterproof and hurricane proof as well. The light that came in the box with this one was outside when our island was hit by Hurricane Elsa. And that light is still working guys. So these lights can take a lick in and they can keep on ticking so these lights have one mode guys one mode yes one mode and in order to turn this light on you have to turn it to the back i don't know if you can see the on and off label in there but this is the on and off switch right here and all you have to do is turn the light on Let's go ahead and do that now. Okay, that's not the right way. Great. So the light is now on guys. So once you place this light outdoors and it is charged by the sun, when night falls, this unit will remain like this. No light, no illumination. If it does detect motion, however, it will illuminate like this. And it will do so for 30 seconds and once motion has ceased or left the area then this light will go off thank you very much one mode that is it as i said before guys i have one of these lights installed outdoors and we are going to take a look at that light and i'm also going to show you how it illuminates at night so this is the solar light at the back of the house. Um, I would say it is installed about it is installed about 12 feet in the air, right above the kitchen window as you see here, and the back door. Okay, guys. So this 
is a general area that we want this light to illuminate at night. This is the wall separating my property and the neighbors. Yeah. Okay guys, so we are back at the back of the house. <laughs> so what I'm going to do, I'm going to walk under the light and it's going to detect motion and you'll be able to see how bright it gets at night. So the light will remain like this for 30 seconds. And once motion has ceased or left the area, and you just saw me walk out of the picture, after 30 seconds, the light goes off. Okay guys, so we are going to do another test. I'm going to go out in front of the light. It is going to detect motion and you will see how well it lights me up. Okay, this is the last test. I'm going to activate this light again and try to pan the general area of illumination. Okay guys, as you would have seen in that demonstration, this light is very bright and it illuminates a large area. Now it is a motion sensor light in every sense of the word in that it only illuminates at night if it detects motion. And once that motion has ceased or left the area, this light goes off. I know some of you would prefer solar lights with a dim mode. That is when night falls, the light automatically illuminates in a dim mode. And once it detects motion, it goes into bright mode. So if you are looking for that type of light, this is not the light for you. This light has one mode. However, since this light is very bright and it illuminates a large area, I would recommend this for an area such as a driveway so that you can have a light that illuminates when you are driving in or walking up to your house. So guys, if you are interested in purchasing this light, I have left an affiliate link in the description below. So thanks for watching. That is all from me today. I will see you in the next video, God willing.